Now to the eyewitness of the forecast with meteorologist Tammy Susan. Tammy, I don't know if a whole lot of people will be eating outdoors this weekend. Mm, yeah, I, especially tomorrow. I think it'll right. be quite chilly. You'll need to have a, <laughs> a, a sturdy coat for tomorrow. Today, yeah, you need to have the coat, maybe even the umbrella if you're going to be al fresco. Uh, we do have clouds across the area. We'll deal with overcast skies all day today. Could you see a peak of sunshine? Probably not, but... If you do, you'll be one of the very, very few that see that. Uh, what we're tracking is a breezy, mild conditions. Temperatures in the low to mid 50s out there for today. A shower or a storm passing, not a washout. These are going to be widely scattered. And it looks like any storm that develops, maybe a little gusty wind, tiny hail or grapple is what you may see from that. Right now we're at 51 in Philadelphia, 45 in Allentown, 47 for Reading. If you're at Mount Pocono, you're at 39 degrees. Down the shore, we're looking at 50 in Atlantic City and Wildwood over in South Jersey. Millville, you are at 50. And Dover in Delaware, you are sitting at 49 degrees. Any warmth to the west? No. <laughs> we're looking at 35 in Pittsburgh. We go off to the northwest is 36 in Buffalo. This is the cold air beginning to descend in. It's the first push of cold air. There is a second one. So I'm showing you the national map because I want to show you this cold air and how it's just sort of leaning toward our area. If you want warmth, that'd be Miami at 81, Phoenix at 95. There's a big ridge out west and they're going to see the warmth, not us. So what happens is we're mild out there today in the 50s, just a little below average. Here comes the first front. This will trigger a shower or a thunderstorm later today. We're chilly behind it. It's a push of cold air. We're into the 40s. The second push of cold air comes through tomorrow evening and we get a brief Arctic blast. We're going to only be in the 30s on Monday. So scattered showers across the area right now. You can even see a few snow showers up into the Poconos where the darker shades of green in upper Bucks County. That is where we're seeing the steadier shower coming to the ground or light steady shower. Over toward Vineland, the same for you in South Jersey. And then we get into uh, Southern Delaware. We're looking at steadier showers down to the south of Long Neck. Here is the main system swirling around out here. Enough cold air being pulled in, enough instability that we are going to see perhaps a thunderstorm pop from all of this. So as we roll through the day, scattered showers in South Jersey. By two, they're across the entire area. A little mix or snow showers in the Poconos. We see isolated thunderstorms by five. Then we clear out. We're looking at a start that is sunny tomorrow, but maybe an isolated snow shower. And then some clouds build in in the afternoon. On Monday, it's just going to be raw, windy, and cold. We'll see a mix of sun and clouds on Monday. So across the region today, 54 for all of us in Philadelphia, 55 down the shore, and 47 with a rain-snow shower in the Poconos. 47 tomorrow feels like 40. It'll be windy. 39 Monday, it feels like the 20s. Look at those overnight lows in the 20s. It starts to uh, modify on Tuesday, sunshine in 40s, and then we get back to the 50s on Wednesday, maybe a very early morning rain-snow mix, and then a shower or thunderstorm for the very last day of March. At least we're back to the 60s then. Right, Tan? Mm -hmm. That's the silver lining there. Yeah. All right, Tammy, thank you.